the use of electronic cigarettes or e-cigarettes is on the rise and has become the new hot topic in public health. But what is an e-cigarette, really? E-cigs are also known as electronic nicotine delivery systems. There are many different shapes and styles of e-cigarettes, but no matter what they look like, all e-cigs work the same way, by vaporizing nicotine. Originally developed in China as a method to help smokers quit, almost all the major tobacco companies have either bought e-cigarette companies or set up in-house development. It is possible to buy e-cigarettes labeled as nicotine-free, but when scientists at the FDA tested these nicotine-free e-cigs, they still found small amounts of nicotine. Nicotine is the highly addictive drug naturally found in tobacco. E-cigarettes are designed to deliver nicotine into the blood, just like regular cigarettes, by smokers inhaling it into the lungs. But how do e-cigarettes contain nicotine if there's no tobacco? Since nicotine cannot be turned into a vapor on its own, it's mixed with chemicals called propylene glycol and vegetable glycerin. This mixture is called e-juice. When a user inhales, the battery heats the e-juice, which becomes a vapor that gets inhaled into the lungs. There are a wide variety of e-cig products, and each contains e-juice with a different amount of nicotine and chemicals. But scientifically, what do we know about this e-juice liquid? Well, not much. Without regulation, companies are not required to inform consumers. E-cigarettes are often marketed as cool and fashionable, but this new trend is delivering nicotine, a highly addictive drug, in varying or unknown amounts.